Hello guys, the Bong is here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play. Mother for the NES, also known as Earthbound Zero, which was a game released only in Japan, and thanks to some guy who decided to like actually buy the actual cartridge, which was very rare at the time. He decided to buy it from Nintendo, which cost a shitload of money, but mind you. And he also found some guy to translate it, turn it to English, and of course the Brom became distributed, all thanks to that hefty sacrifice of money. So thanks to him, we finally get to enjoy this game in North America. Let's play it, shall we? Uh, let's yeah, erase this file, that was just a practice run. Okay, what is this boy's name? Well, his real name is Ninten. Oh, but I'm actually gonna give him my name. Even though he kinda looks like Charlie Brown. I mean, look at him. Like, good fucking grief. Okay, that's good. Okay, what is this girl's name? Uh, to me, she's just a whore, you know? I'll just go with that. I'm gonna put a space in there. Uh, it doesn't look like I can. I'll just put a dot or whatever. Let's go with that. Mind you, I'm not a children's elf here. I'm gonna say some shit I shouldn't. What is this boy's name? I'm just gonna call him... Douchebag, but of course that's not gonna be enough room. I'm just gonna call him D-Bag. Yeah, that's good enough. And what is this last boy's name? Kinda looks like Frankenstein and Arnold Schwarzenegger. I'm just gonna call him... Eh, what the hell, I'll just call him... No, not ass, and it's just too easy. I'm gonna call him Pooper. Yeah, that's good enough. What is your favorite food? Um... Let's see, I... I think I would like... Um, bullshit. Yeah, I want some bullshit. Yeah. Give us some shit to drink. Yeah. Uh, can I put an exclamation point? No, I can't. Oh, well. Banga, a whore, douchebag, pooper, favorite food, bullshit. That's good enough. In the early 1900s, a dark shadow covered a small country town in rural America. At that time, a young married couple vanished mysteriously from their home. The man's name was George. The woman's name was Maria. Two years later, as suddenly as he left, George returned. He never told anyone where he had been or what he had done. Cheating, I guess. But he began an odd study, all by himself, masturbation. As for Maria, his wife, she never returned. I wonder why. Eighty years have passed since then. Eighty years? That's like a, a hundred years or something. Oh yeah, so finally we get to play the game. Of course, B is how to run. You can move diagonally, which is pretty cool. Yeah, this is a very simple game. If you played Earthbound for the SNES, you should get used to this, no problem. And I'm gonna get attacked by a killer lamp. I know those lines were up to no good. Should have got a new one. So I'm gonna have to attack with the plastic bat. Well, actually, I don't have the plastic bat yet. I'm just using them. I might think I might be using my fists or something. Yeah, I'm punching a lamp. Either that, or I'm using a bat to hit it. Yay, vandalism in the home for the win. I guess I'll take out another lamp. I already bought one. Since that lamp is having a seizure, I'll have to put it out of its misery. But yeah, the, the only thing unfortunate about this RPG is you gotta level grind. Like, I know, it's a regular RPG and you level grind all the time. No, 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 no. Get this. Get this. You have to level grind at the beginning of the game. The fucking beginning. Like, if you level grind at the beginning of the game, that's because you just want to be extra prepared. But no, this is necessary. Oh my, brother, our house is falling apart! Woohoo! Eh, fuck you! I'm just gonna go over there and 
kick some ass. Help me! That's a killer doll. Why does I have no clothes? Yeah, so I think my sister is sexually dangerous. I mean, why else would that doll be naked? Yeah, I mean, it looks like a surf, but a completely nude in the Jesus Christ dance. As if he's being crucified. Anyways, I'll just fight this doll. I can't believe it, I'm fighting a doll. What's wrong with me? Such is the norm in the Mother Universe. But yeah, I'm ready for this. Oh good, I finally beat the boss. Well, some of the mini-boss. I win! I moved to level 2. Bite has increased by 2. Speed has increased by 3. Nice. Wisdom has increased by 3. Strength has increased by 2. Force has increased by 2. And that's it! The phenomenon has stopped. For the moment. I was scared to death! Oh wow! Check out what's hidden inside the doll! Of course, check is catalyzed, you know what this means. Inside the da I spotted a doll, I spotted an old music box. As the music box was wound up, a melody began to play. I remember the tune. And yet, you're gonna need those tunes for later. Brother, here's some juice! You are thirsty, aren't you? Okay, since there's a chance to actually hoard some juice, or well, orange juice for my sister, I might as well just... What the? You fucking bitch! Don't walk, walk away from me! I was talking to you! Yeah, so I'll just hold the turbo key and pick up as much as I want until I have the maximum amount of my inventory. Unfortunately, I cannot carry too much of my inventory. Let's see how much I can carry, really. I'll start as the map. I can only carry eight things! Oh, well, granted, I'm eight years old, so I mean, eight years olds can only carry only carry so much, right? Hey, Mama. Are you all right, Dad? What is happening to our house? I wish your dad were here now. Maybe telephone. Oh, I'm gonna please get it. Oh, fine, you lazy asshole. I had to talk to the telephone in order to grab it. It's real nice. This is your dad. Well, it seems like a poltergeist. I'm not exactly sure how to, but your great great grandfather, great grandfather, studied P studied PSI. You might find something in the basement to help, but I left the basement key someplace. Can't remember exactly where. Anyhow, son, you are my only hope. It's time for you to go on a little adventure, even though you're eight years old and look like Charlie Brown, and explore the potential of your powers. Powers not be taken lightly. Bonga, go for it. But remember to come back and check on your family. Bye. Oh, phone me, and I will save your progress. Call me whenever you want. Slam. Slam! It's like, call me whenever you want. Glam! Are you alright? Oh, God. She's gonna say the same thing, isn't she? Okay, so I have to don't talk to the dog in order to get the key. Believe it or not, I had to figure this out on my own. Thanks to Game Facts. I am Minnie. No, really? Did I really need you to tell me your name and throw you my sister? Oh, right, I was supposed to say leave. Um, uh, I'll leave some more shoes. Seeing as how I can have it any time, I might as well store it in case I need it. But I don't need it now. I'd rather have some room in my inventory for other shit. Eh, sure, why not? Uh, yes, I uh, keep some orange juice. Yeah, you gave me so much, you might as well take it too. No, wait, I don't think this is my sister. Because my s uh, Maybe it is, I don't know. Son of mine, you're perfect, I thought. Why can't you let you go on a journey so famished? I'll cook bullshit! Eat your dinner and rest for the night. Oh, right, that's gonna be a good dinner. When you want to eat bullshit again, <laughs> just come back here. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to save my game. I've transferred $50 into your account. Hey, nice! After the amount you spent, the balance is $50. Spend your money wisely. Okay, so apparently I had to fight enemies, even though it will tell me, not tell me how much money I get. You actually gain money. You have to talk to your father in order to get that money in your account. You have to go to an ATM. 
to actually pick up the money so you can use for yourself. Yeah, I'll continue. Yeah, like my mom, I don't ever want to stop. So anyways, I'm going to stop the video right here in the next part. We'll do part two and actually do some level grinding. Oh joy. Goodbye, everyone.